Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be doing some more uh, Fallout 76. Uh, this is going to be a different kind of video. Um, first of all, um, quite a while ago, I did a video and I showed off my daily routine. And we like went here. No, uh, my camp was over here at the time. So we did a lot of things and... But see, things have changed uh, since the Wastelanders came out, and now they've changed again. So a lot of things are different. Like before, there were scorched uh, in certain places, and now there's uh, actual humans. Um, they have changed the uh, way damage is being done. So I've decided to update that video and. Do another series, uh, basically the same thing, but only with all the new, uh, new stuff that they have added in. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Now, this is my base slash store. It's called Goody Goodies. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Goody Goodies is now open. Hey Beckett, what's up, buddy? Now Beckett has a daily too. Once you complete his quest, you'll be able to get in there and do for him. So the first thing I do, go up here, check out all my stuff. Collect all my crops first. Collecting the crops. I'm not sure how long these videos will be, but this is not part of my regular playthrough, by the way. And since I moved my base, I no longer have a uh, junk extractor, which is fine, because my sash keeps getting full, and I keep gotta keep having to like. Deal with it. Ooh, plasma cartridges, yay. You complete the uh, Raiders quest line and become fully uh, like aligned with them. Get all your reputation up there. You can unlock this for some gold bullion. An ammo machine. This I got, which I would usually use, but it does not work. I'd use that every day with uh, everything else I do, but it doesn't work. <clears throat> Bethesda has to fix that. I wish they would hurry up. Let's rest here. So that way we could get some bonus experience. Now normally I would have some cranberry cobbler or cranberry relish as well because I would uh, eat that and I don't have any of that. So we have to go get that. Cause cranberry relish and cranberry jam and uh, cranberry cobbler. They'll all give you bonuses for experience. Awesome. We're well rested. Goody goody. Okay. Let's go in here and collect. That's some new nifty weapons. <laughs> oh, that's another thing I do. I used to do all solo, completely nothing, but now I like to create a team. Casual. Because I do have some perk cards that, you know, kind of will benefit me and boost me up. So. Um. Nothing in my fridge at the moment. That's normally where I keep my cranberry cobblers and other such things like that, so that way they don't go bad real quick. Like I said, they do help with experience.
And I'll grab up some dirty water just until I get bored with it. And I'll start crafting stuff. Okay, what do we got? Um, all the drinks. Let's do our boiled water first. Okay. And carrot soup. That's good for perception. Corn soup is good for AP regen. Um, that's it. And everything else that I wasn't able to, uh, craft there because I don't have either the materials or you know whatever like uh, any other crops that I picked um, I will sell make money that way so that's always a good idea um, you should definitely use green thumb perk when uh, picking your crops or any plants or fauna then I'll get well tuned so that I can go on my merry way. Yeah, I'm pretty good. All right, we're done. <laughs> oh, while we're here, I wanna do something else here. Um, apparel. I got this and that's cool and all. We're going to be coming out with the, oh, what do you call it? Mannequins? Uh, I gather, so, yeah. Let me decide what I want to use. I kind of like the fashionable raider outfit. Fashionable raider outfit. I'm aware of that. Awesome. I can't really see it, can I? Let's get in here where there's more light. Okay, that's what the fashionable raiders outfit looks like. I normally always keep the uh, stealth suit head armor on. Okay, the first thing I do, let's go to the crater. Start there and I work my way down the map. Okay, here we are in Crater. Oh, we got Daily Retirement. That's a good one. Uh, there's actually two uh, things in here. Uh, there's two dailies you can get. They, um, they switch each day, like tomorrow will be another one. So, and that'll be over there in that building. But for now, we can go talk to her. Talk to Roxy. Yeah, like if I logged in tomorrow, over there in that building, will be the other daily. There's two of them here. Now uh, the settlers only have one, so. Have I'll also be using this video as uh, kind of a test video to, uh, you know, see if I have to do something different as far as my YouTube goes. <laughs> so. Gonna use this for a few things. Uh, okay, Roxy. Name for you, kid. Go get him. Oh, just tell me what to do. You're not a flake. I'm impressed. I had a hunter follow the trail earlier, so I think these directions will get you close enough. If you only find a corpse, well, that's fine. Maybe the others got there first. I just want to know that it's done. 
Okay, I can do that. So we can go intercept the hunters, or we can go deal with the former raiders. While we're here, let's sell him some stuff. You want to live to fight do. Day, huh? Shrug off a grenade or two. By here. We got like 81 stim packs. I don't know. Do I really need that many? quality protection. They don't know how lucky they are. I mean, I'm not gonna get rid of them though. No. Uh, if I have enough purified water, I normally sell that too. Okay, everything that I picked that I cannot make anything with, I will sell. Quality. Oops, I didn't mean to sell the corn soup. That's okay. I was not paying attention. Ah. I mean, after a little while, it does add up. I mean, I've had up to like 5,000 5, gold. Or caps, excuse me. By doing all this. I, I can't get over that, though. <laughs> I've always spent more than, uh, <laughs> more than I make. So, so, I never get over 5,000 caps, like, ever. If I catch you stealing my stuff, you're okay, we're not going to be able to, we might be able to walk to here, but I don't know. Let's see. Where do we got to go? What do we got? Okay, deal with the former raider. They're down here. If you wait a minute, you can see uh, and kind of in which direction there. It's like, see, they moved up there. They're going this way. So if we... Let's go here. I don't know if I want to go there. Hold on. Maybe here. Well, I haven't even discovered that yet. Wow. That's incredible. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're just going to go here. That costs a lot of caps to travel there. I don't have... Uh, I don't think I have travel agent on. I'll have to look. But if I'd have had travel agent on, it would not have cost me as much. So, all right, we need to look at our map here. And we're going the wrong way. Er, turn around. Okay, we're going to head right towards this guy. Now, if I happen to run into the raiders, or to the uh, other hunters that are hunting this former raider down, I will bribe them off. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. Otherwise, if I don't have to deal with them, I don't. Oh, hey, buddy. Okay, there he's former raider. And almost always, who would the cranberry glade? Look, civilization is a failed experiment. Stay alone, stay alive. Now, fuck off. Okay, wow, you're not very nice. Okay, well, I can use my perception. Hand over all the ca those caps in your pocket, and I'll tell Roxy you're Seriously? dead. Seriously? <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I always do that. Take it and get out of my face, asshole. Gets me more caps. Now, if he's going to be a jerk about it... <laughs> Sorry, buddy. You're a jerk. Okay. Cranberry Glade. I can't believe I never discovered that. Man, there's a few places I haven't been. Holy cow. And I'm like level, uh, what level am I? 118. <laughs> so, yeah. 
I've got some exploring to do, I guess. Okay, we go all the way back to Roxy. Another thing that you could do every day, if uh, if the Scorch Beast Queen event pops up, you know, make sure and do that. If the uh, event with Earl Williams pops up, that's a good one to do as well. Hey, 76, if you get up to any trouble, you'll be sure to bring me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> will do. Yeah, my reputation with these guys is like maxed. Can I cross this name off my list or what? Oh, yes you can. Appalachia has a new corpse. That's the best option to say. Uh, no matter whether he's dead or not, always say that one. If he's not dead, it'll give you the option to lie. But nice yeah, word. always say it because you get be the best uh, rewards for this. Hunters here. Thanks for dealing with this, kid. So you're due some payment here. Hard work deserves real pay. Now, sir. Well, thank you. Well, you go causing problems. Okay, we got some script. And we also got, let's see, a bunch of junk I don't need. And treasury notes. Treasury notes are always a good thing. I mean, I'm pretty well maxed out on what I what I wanted to buy. So yeah, I don't have very much to uh, spend my treasure notes on. I mean, I got my Secret Service armor, I got the, uh, the ammo thing, I got the uh, garden plots, you know, anything that's useful. You know, I didn't want to get anything that's just really not useful. I, I did not get any of the weapons though because uh, they don't fit my build. But I mean, it's up to you if you got a build that it fits. Like, you know, if you want the plasma caster per se, you know, go for it. I don't know much about the plasma caster because I have not used it. <laughs> so. But I've got all the Secret Service armor, most of which is Vanguard's. Um, this one, the most. I picked this one because, well. It lets me blend in with the environment when I'm crouching and not moving. So it makes my sniper build pretty good. Okay, and I receive less limb damage. So that's a good one. But it's called the Poisoners. It's got the Poisoners ability on it. But I wasn't too worried about that because it only does 25%. It's just extra poison resistance that, you know. I mean, I could have got the same effects with the Chameleon without the poisoning effect, but. And I'm also experimenting with the right arm I keep making pieces to see which one's gonna be better for my playstyle. I do have a Vanguard one um, in my stash at home as well as a unyielding one at home so I'm just experimenting with those seeing what I like the next thing I do go all the way down here to the overseer's home Oop. Oop.
Okay, here we are at the Overseer's home. Let's start a daily opportunity. Uh, we'll go in and turn that one on. Or photo opportunity, yeah. I said daily, didn't I? Sorry. <laughs> photo opportunity. I uh, don't want stinger ammo. Ooh, look at cherry. Uh, anything I could take to scrap or sell, I will do. Going in. Now, you don't have to be the uh, casual team to do this. You can do it solo, you know, using the Lone Wanderer perk or whatever. I just do it for the extra benefits now because, I mean, I pretty much completed all the all the main missions and the majority of the side missions, so. We got anything I can take. I'll take whatever I can find in here. Okay. Scrappity, scrappity. Oop. Beautiful thing. Okay. Let's talk to Davenport. Sir, good to see you again. Are you up good for to see you too. photo reconnaissance mission? Um, sure. Okay, I'm up for helping again. Which settlement do you intend to gather information about? Oh, Billy let's go with the crater. Here. Good luck, and do be careful. Those crater folk are rather excitable. You might have hey, spotted hey, the crop nice. fields near the crater. Those crops help to provide the raiders with a steady supply of food. Should the crops okay. fail, the raiders would be forced to seek other food sources, and a violent clash with Foundation would likely follow. Being forewarned of such a development is vitally important. One possible area for raider expansion is the old Black Bear Lodge, located to the crater's southwest. We'd like to see if the raiders have made any forays to the lodge, and a photograph would be most helpful in that regard. There's always some risk involved in these photographic excursions, so do be careful. Good luck to you. Okay. Well, that's pretty easy. I wish I got anything I want to take. Oh, we're going to take her pumpkin pie. Also, I heard it go off when I was down there talking to him. I seem to be thirsty. So, I'll leave those for the overseer. Clean up your floor now. <laughs> okay. Oh, this red way I got. Pumpkin pie. Nuka cherry. Uh, carrot soups gives me perception, so we're gonna do that real quick. And we'll do a blackberry juice as well. Mm. Purified water, that should take care of all that. Nice. Do I have anything to eat? Eat some spices, because, you know, whatever. <laughs> Oh, pumpkin pie. Okay. Now, all my stuff is full. So I'm getting bonuses for, let's see, I've got the well tuned Kidder Spirit, which is well rested, but because I have a uh, companion in my camp, uh, Blackberry Juice, Carrot Soup, Pumpkin Pie. So, well hydrated. 
Now that I'm well hydrated, I've got uh, Max on that. Well fed. Okay. So yeah, AP Gen for uh, the water. Being, uh, you know, well thirsty. Or not thirsty. Um, <laughs> well hydrated. Well thirsty. Er. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, just can't speak today. Okay, so now we have to go take some pictures. Um, so we have to go here and back here. So let's go here first to Crater. Now one of the changes that uh, one of the updates gave us is it used to cost you caps to fast travel to creator or foundation no longer does it cost you caps so those are now freebies Supposed to be taking pictures of these crops. Pro snap camera. Click and done. And now we can go over to the Black Bear Lodge. So, also, I wanted to mention one more thing. Um, besides doing all of this, plus the other stuff we're going to be doing, I always try to take over, you know, at least one, at some point when I log in, at least one, uh, you know, like, uh, factory type thing. Like, uh, I've already got Crafted Steel, which is really good, so... And hopefully this guy doesn't take it from me. Because, I mean, you know, at least one, uh, you know, outpost or whatever you call them, workshops. And then hopefully I can keep it for my whole playthrough today as long as I keep playing. That'll give me, like, good materials. Plus uh, the original takeover plus the defense. Give me nice, bo nice bonuses and stuff. Anybody here? No, good, okay. Good deal. Normally there's some uh, enemies here that you gotta fight off, but I got lucky today. Yay. Okay. We are gonna go back to the Overseer's Hops. Back to the overseer's house.
All right, back inside. Go back down to the basement. Uh, let's see. Uh, sometimes it gives me certain options, like let's see if I drink. A little lower my intelligence. That's not a good. Kind of want the intelligent one. Um, anything that could boost my intelligence? I don't think I do. Well, bummer. Okay, so we'll see what he says. Ah, you Dead returned. Report. Do you have the photographs I asked for? I do. Got everything you asked for. Ah, very good. Very good. I did promise a reward, so please accept these caps in gratitude for your service. Uh, okay. Okay, there we go. Like, I try to do this one all the time, the intelligence one. Uh, a better reward would be a strong incentive to get my help in the future. So, yeah. I've actually never done this one, the Charisma, so I'm not sure what that does, so I don't know. If you get the opportunity to do it, go ahead and leave me a comment, let me know what happens. I right, can't use this argue one. with your logic, and it's true, I'll want to collect more photographs in the future. Uh, very well, I'll increase the reward. Here are your caps. Come and see me again, and I might have more work for you. Pleasure doing business with you. Now, if I wanted to, I could have, like, just sold the pictures to the other faction. Which sometimes I'll do. Like, I was doing that when I wanted to get my Raider faction up there. But, for the most part, I will turn them back into him. Ah, look. I'm going to clean up your floor, Overseer. I mean, you got a mess here. Really, you got a broom, you can use it, you know. Okay. Well, sometimes there's like loose springs here. And I'm actually currently in need of loose springs. So I was hoping, but nope. Um, we have an attack on Graphite Steel Yard. Reclaim your workshop from intruders. Well, this guy must have taken it. Yeah, it's whatever. He can have it. I really don't care. He can have it. I got what I needed out of it. Okay, so we're going to go down. And we're going to go to Foundation now is our next stop Okay, that starts the quest vital equipment when we get here. Which is one of our dailies. Well, I will do these certain dailies every day, like these three in particular. Because they always give you like script and you know, treasury notes. You know, useful things that you could, you know, use. Well, at least it's nice out. Another day of hard work. Finally, yeah. someone with the guts to help. When we went to get our intrusion module, it was gone. We think it was taken by a thief. If you can get it back, we'd be very grateful. Grateful enough to pay you. We know. Okay. 
Sure, sounds right up my alley. Fortunately, we put tracking transmitters into the really sensitive stuff like that. I can show you roughly where it is, but you'll have to wait until you're closer to get an exact fix on it. Okay, well, we got his quest, and now we're gonna go. What the heck is a John anyway? Uh, see, this guy just here Jim's will give you the stuff for your gold bullion respect. here. You know what I, mean? I didn't really want much of anything from him. I bought most of my stuff from the Raiders, and I did a mission to it. So I've already got the Chinese stealth suit. I got that for like nothing. <laughs> didn't have to pay for it. However, I did buy the plan for the farmable dirt tiles. Jen's got style because that I can those respect. are kind of important. You know what I mean? I can't believe I lost my Nuka Tepper saves. Ah. Turn in what I got. It'll give me 60, not a big deal. Yeah, it gives me 160 now. Cool. Not too worried about it. I kind of do it every day. Until I, you know, decide to spend it. I don't need much, so I don't spend a lot of it. So from here on in, I mean, yesterday I just bought the last of everything I needed. So here on in, I'll be getting, uh, it'll just be adding up, so that's fine. But eventually, if I decide to buy something, I will go down to the Secret Service bunker or back to the Raiders or the Settlers. Okay, so we have to find his missing property. Turn on our tracker. And let's find out where it is on the map. It looked like it was just there. What happened? Oh, okay. Well, hold on. Okay, there it is. Oh, look at that. It's by the White Springs Golf Course. Well, that's a good thing. I mean, sometimes you'll get lucky and you just can go do things that make things worth your time. Like, I could do a run-through of the golf course right now. <laughs> as well as get all this crap. I used to do the golf club, or the golf course every day. I mean, let's go find this guy, and then maybe we'll do a run through. I don't know. Okay. Uh, Ninety-six percent. Let's go this way. See if it goes up. Ten percent. Twelve percent, twenty six, forty, getting closer. Uh, no, for the apocalypse, they take really good care of it. What is going on? Oh, you're not firing at me, thank God. <laughs> I was like, oh no. Oh, we're getting closer. Okay, Blood Eagles have it. I'm pretty sure we're going to come up on a camp here. What? Attack me. <laughs> oh, 61. We're heading away from it now.
57. Right, so what is it going to be up there? Still in caution. Ooh, he's dead. Well, that didn't take much to get back. You guys have anything good? At least I could sell. sell the floater grenades. I don't really like the floater grenades, they're kind of garbage. Oh! Hi, puppy! by Mr. Farrell Goal, who has some really good stuff on you. I'll take your chalk too. Okay, apparently I've already been up here. Because a lot of times it'll give you the Thing where you can unlock new locations from up in one of these. Okay, so we have found what we needed to. Now we can go back to Ward. And yeah, we'll do the golf course another time. Because <laughs> uh, that is going to be something else I do on, you know, a daily basis. But sometimes I don't do that one, so. Right, head back to Foundation. Over there. 
I see you have our missing property. Well, yes, I did. Uh, piece of cake. They never knew what hit him. Um, I had to kill him. Um, if you want to get your reputation up with these guys, pick this one. That's very generous. Foundation thanks you. I'll get this intrusion module integrated. Good thing those raiders didn't know it was missing. Thanks. Because even though you pick that one, you'll still get gold. Or caps, excuse me. Uh, you'll still get your treasury uh, notes. And you'll still get script. What the heck is a John anyway? I just don't get it. That puts us up to 190. I mean, a few more days and I'll be able to, uh, you know, have more. I mean, I could do events and such. So, oh, I just noticed uh, there's a new person on my team. <laughs> The same guy that took over my, uh, that took over my, my metal place, <laughs> which is fine. Now this girl here, if you talk to her, she'll start you on the quest to uh, go and deal with uh, Earl Williams. So yeah, that's our uh, dailies. That's our three main uh, dailies that we can do. I mean, yes, we do have the other dailies, but I mean, they, they don't give you as much. Now, daily ops, however, I might actually just do a uh, video on uh, this by itself. Uh, load on death. Oh, huh. that might be kind of one yeah but I might do a video on that by itself but also during my daily routine I will run up through I mean I'll go up through here and I will go to a few other places like over here and you know what let's do that now if I go here, I could grab up all my uh, all the cranberries I want. You could also go to the cranberry bog if you want to. You don't have to go here. This is just kind of an easy place to go. But the cranberry bog has like a lot of like diseased cranberries. Uh, those are even better than regular cranberries because you can make like uh, cranberry relish and I think cranberry jam out of it. Okay, uh, leader of the pack has popped up. I'm not going to be doing that. I mean, I could. You know, during your daily, like, you know, everything you're doing, if something pops up, you know, feel free to do it. You know, the more the merrier. You know, keep yourself going here. You'll have, like, bolt flies and stuff here. And that's where that poison immunity comes into. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I normally start like from a tractor and I'll work my way along the edge. And if I see cranberries, pick them up. Because if you do the cranberries, you can make some good stuff, I'm telling you. And the, the diseased cranberries are even better.
Oh. So he's doing the, uh... Ha! He's doing that mission. Okay. I think that's my, part, my uh, partner, too. So I guess we're doing leader of the pack. <laughs> Junkie Shrag Knock Axe. Good deal. Okay, let's go do this other one. Oh, we only got one second to complete it. Okay, that's okay. Because I was mostly uh, concerned about that other thing. Now we're going to swap weapons out here. And then after that, I could go down here. But I will do that another time, so. But once you get your cranberries, you can go back to your base and you can cook them up. And they're probably actually the easiest thing to get. So. And then I will stock my fridge up with them. All food. Um, every cobbler. Oh, I do have super duper equipped. That will help. Oh, well, maybe I don't have super duper equipped. Anyways, it's a good idea to equip super duper if you have it. Let me jump out of here real quick. I'll show you. I'll equip super duper. Bloody mess, we'll take that off. That's one of my favorites. Now, ah, with Super Duper, you have the chance of, like, doubling everything you do. Everything you craft. Which, it didn't work that time. But that's okay. <laughs> I should have had it equipped earlier. Okay, so all these are going to go in my fridge. That'll stop it from spoiling. Except one. I will not put the one in there. Because I will use it. Oh, he's giving me a gift. Check that out. Oh. Cranberry relish, cranberry cobbler. Excellent, excellent. Thank you, sir. Also, let's see. Another good thing to do, especially when you're in a party, is to open a lunchbox. Okay, so... Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I'm glad, grateful that you two did. 
Um, and I will catch you next time uh, in my next video. Oh, cool. He's sharing one too now. Awesome. So, anyways, folks, if you did enjoy, please like and subscribe. Go ahead and hit the bell so you know when I do the next one. And I will catch you next time. Have a good one.